Greetings, Commanders! Welcome to Crash Landing, the Elite Dangerous Community Show. Ah, oh, what a show we've got tonight. I have got so much planned, it's really crazy. Uh, instead of my usual one or two guests, yes, I have all... Wow, no, I, I've got most of the EGX Ambassadors. Ah. Uh, oh, I was just screaming at the screen. And, uh, and, and I they, the they weren't even listening. Me. Hello! Hello. <laughs> Sorry. Hello. Crash! I was like, ah, oh, he's waffling oh. on again. Oh, it's Crash. How are you doing? Oh, dear. There you go. How are you guys doing? Ill. Four out of Very well. <laughs> Voice has recovered. Yeah. 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 Uh, excited about the new beta. It's Yay. excellent. 2.04 just hit this afternoon. It's got a heck of a lot of bug fixes. My hat goes off to the guys in front of you. They really have just pulled out all the stops to get this done for us tonight. And Altal's just joined. <laughs> Greetings, Altal. <laughs> so we literally, we'll literally we'll just have a quick roll call of all the guys that have managed to get on tonight. Oh god, Altal's <laughs> Wow. <laughs> wow. Can, you, can you hear me? Wow. <laughs> I can hear you, I can hear you. So we've got Commander Arathon. We could hear Hi. you and EastEnders and everything. <laughs> and everything I just else. turned it down. <laughs> we've got Commander Blocks. Hello. We've got Commander Altal. Hello! Commander Elan. Good evening! Commander Grimmy. Hi there! Commander Max Ursa. Who's left? I think building. he's away telling his. his <laughs> <story>. <laughs> Reading stories to a small child. <laughs> Commander Moly. Hi! <laughs> Commander Tetrick. <laughs> Hello! So we've got a good, uh, what's that, eight or nine of us from EGX. What did you guys think of EGX? It was fantastic. Brilliant. Fantastic. Jolly good fun. <laughs> was it as crazy as you thought it would be? Yes. It was rather <laughs> manic. Yeah. Uh, more so. <laughs> yeah, I did try to warn you. I did, but oh my word. it's uh, It was really great fun though. I think it was just brilliant to see people's reactions, wasn't it? Just, you know, come away from the gating. Oh, wow, this is really cool. Has anyone done the math where to figure out how many people we actually yeah. sat, chat, <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Well, I reckon, reckon somewhere in excess of three and a half thousand. I was going to say, yeah. it was, was going to be I mean, 15 of us every 10 minutes. You yeah, know, exactly. Five, five minutes for chat, five minutes play time. You know, every 10 minutes throughout the day, like two or three half hour breaks. <sighs> Still a lot of people. And the reactions were so positive though. I don't think I had anyone that kind of walked away and went, oh, it's a bit late. Or anything. Everyone was like, wow. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, it was it was great though. I really did enjoy it. It was so much fun, and it, it was great to see such a range of people, wasn't it? You know, we had we had all sorts of ages and uh, groups of people, and you know, fathers with their uh, daughters and sons and everything. It was just it was really really good. Really enjoyed it. Well, it wasn't just a stereotype of kind of the fat sweaty nerd that lives in his mother's basement. You know, you've got sort of uh, attractive young women and uh, you know dads and little kids and sort of middle aged men and middle-aged women and all sorts of people. There wasn't any sort of one set stereotype, typical kind of age group or demographic. It was everybody. Yeah, it was nice. It was good to see. It was tiring, but great. Oh, well, you've done it before, haven't you, Koresh? <laughs> I'm a glutton for punishment. I think that's what it is. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back in 10 minutes or so. You said you had practice. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> and I'm back now. Ah, Grimmy, how you doing? Grimmy's just disappeared. Grimmy's just disappeared. That's Max Harrison. Sorry. You should have been. I'm just... Yeah. Where are we meeting then? Watch the well, I'm uh, flying to Asban City at... Um, uh, yeah, I think we're getting some feedback off somewhere. Which we're going? I think it's Altel. It could be me, because I'm just adjusting all the volumes at the moment. I don't know what these buttons do on the microphone. Well, blame you. Oh, Why turn Karakino that down? Is that, is that better? <laughs> <laughs> that's seems worse. Uh, that that's seems to work. Yeah, that's fine. That seems can't hear EastEnders, I can hear you, that's good. <laughs> I've put EastEnders on mute now. I just turned the TV on when I got home and EastEnders <laughs> came on. I don't actually watch it, I have to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> I was just going to watch Channel 4 News. Yeah, yeah. EastEnders or Crash? We're blue, yeah. your thousands would. So are we, are we going into open play or private group? Private group. I'm just going to drop out of um, Super Cruiser Azaban City and like 
a few seconds and then I will make sure that you're in the group. Do you know which group to join? No. It's a group that's the same as my commander name. And which is Don't that? say it. Don't Arathol. say it. Oh, Arathol. <laughs> Hello, Colm. Hello, Colm. Hordes. Hordes of people. Where, where are we meeting? Uh, I see uh, you Aaron in Super in Cruise, Arathon. I'm right behind you. Uh, well, I was. Oop. I've just dropped out. You just dropped out, yeah. I just got it here. Well, I've got a quick ask the menu to let L tell into the group, so. Have I won the race to Bear the other end of space? I think I have, haven't I? Because I've, I've literally just left the uh, system at the other end of the capsule right now. We've got no other thing to do. I just had to do it. As soon as, as soon as I got enough jump range, I was like, I want to see what's there. Ah, okay. Um, thank you for that. Thank you for posting. Right, friends in private groups. Ring ring. Groups. Oh, oh, oh. Group. Ring ring banana phone. <laughs> okay. No. Um, no. That's probably my phone. I'll just ignore it. <laughs> Have you found my group tell? So you go back to the friends and private friends and groups management. Uh, search for group error, and then I'll and then request to join. And I'll add you Ethan in. With Ian. Yes, I have the vanishing of Ethan card. Wait, where? 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 It's my birthday, it, yeah, isn't it? Yeah! What's gonna be in it? More! 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 Just more. Just more. More beta. More stuff. The universe will just get bigger. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah, it pretty crazy that they're yeah, ramping up pace. I mean, that's the thing. They've added more so they can work on more simultaneously. That's the, uh, that's the beauty of it, really. It's all the more awesome. 50% <laughs> more awesome each time. Right, so... Mm -hmm. Grundane's just joined the group, so I'm just waiting for it to tell and then... Oh. The I've accepted the group membership, but it doesn't come up when I go to private groups. Yeah, I had that huh. earlier. Uh, yeah, I just quit it to get that too. Come on. Oh, that's a pain. Um, like I said, I had problems quiet. joining the group. Yeah, it doesn't, it doesn't show you in the group, it just shows everyone else. I apologise if I'm quiet. Did, did you re request <laughs> to be in the group, or did you send him an invite? Uh, I think I, I sent an invite. an invite. Yeah, and I accepted it. Yeah, d don't just request an invite because before me and Ryan were having problems when we accepted an invite but requesting seems to work fine well I did with this one anyway yeah, well, oh, right. so I just might just try that to bury your wife in the garden to just to play it I, I've already sent it but <laughs> oh, well, uh, I'm, I'm at Azkaban City or Azaban City whatever it's called I keep getting them mixed up with Harry uh, what's Azerbaijan <laughs> Azkaban Orbital Prison <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't help on wearing really need to play, but that's coming in beta for you guys <laughs> that's it that's it confirmed you've spoiled it now uh. <laughs> so I'm going to uh, I'm going to head back to you guys I'm just doing a little bit of exploration I don't know if you guys have you done any exploration at the moment no yes I don't know what I'm doing it's I only when it's forced on me yeah. <laughs> you arrive in a system, it's like, I can't see anything, I don't know where ah. anything is. I better buy my scanner. Well, at the moment I'm just kind of racking up some credits so I can get enough of the ship to do some exploring. You I'd can do that uh, while you're exploring, by selling the data. That's, that's the great thing about it, I mean, it's you get so much money from exploring. I mean, if you go around a couple of bodies in a system, you can make like a couple of grand quite easily. Okay, so excuse my ignorance, how do I do that? Yeah. Well, every every single ship now has a discovery scanner built into it, um, right. which shows up in the oh, fire yes. I don't think it's defined to a uh, fire button by default, so you have to go into the fire groups and actually set it. Yeah. Uh, once you've done that, you jump into one of the systems that's maybe a couple of jumps away from the core ones, and they may not have the map data in your ship's computer. So yep. by doing that, you can then scan them, literally just fire at them. You can do it in super cruise, you can do it normal speed, and right. then you gather data in your ship's computer about that body. That's actually worth money to the cartographic Universal Cartographics. So uh, you can take it back to any station, go into the Universal Cartographics, and right down the bottom there'll be a set of options to sell the data. Tasty. And, fingers crossed, the further away from that location you scan, the more expensive the uh, data is. Right, okay, so you're basically sort of um, 
which is why I'm yeah, heading back with a nice big juicy chunk of data from the furthest star system. <laughs> So yeah, I was pop in and, uh, so like a Google Street View van all. driving around the universe. Um, yeah, I'm just scooching around in my transit van. Yeah. I was making a decent amount of money till I upgraded to the detailed surface scan. I'm trying to figure out how to use it. Oh yeah, I want I want to see the um, the more. Hi, Blocky. Blocky. Missed. You, you're Still chasing not each other. Seeing you in my group, Peltel. Uh, I should be in your group now, because I'm in the game now, and I did a private group marathon. Oh, so ducking away quickly. I'm flying okay. around oh, Azkaban City. Aren't we all? I can't Backwards see any human landing pad here. What's that? Like I haven't seen for a while. I've got a backwards landing pad. Oh, I had that before. Yeah. I'm... It's always fun when I don't realise until I hit the ground. <laughs> Right, where are where? we heading? Who's getting shot? Hey, Everybody I'm stop running. getting shot. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got backwards one as well. So I found a couple of these outposts now. I don't know if you guys have seen it. I found some with like a showroom with some of the big ships in. Have you seen that? Oh! I don't know if it's just these oh, ones which are from no. very, very distant. I got this one here. It's got an anaconda, a couple of cobras, an eagle. Two eagles. Does it have a smarmy sails? <laughs> I don't know, but I've got, I haven't got no lasers to fend him off, so I ain't getting any closer. I did like the uh, thing in the newsletter, you see the guys have put in a option to tone down the GUI effects, have you seen that? I did indeed. Yeah. I mean that's quite nice, I mean there's, you know, there's feedback, yeah. they say like people having like, kind of like, headaches from the flickering and things like that, it's quite nice that they thought about that and added that in. Whoa! Yeah. It's like we've got a Psycho Cloud channel as well. Like blindness options, but... have, we, have we got a lot of echo? Oh yes. Echo. In Elta Ola's echoing. Not quite the god voice. <laughs> Turn it down a bit more. <laughs> Karakina's uh, asking me to look out for ammonia-based planets. <laughs> I've got one of these Turtle Beach headsets, but I don't actually know how to use all the buttons on it. Oh. <laughs> I've got one, Defeated but I didn't realise I've modern got technology. On it. Yeah. Oh yes. Just a setting in uh, Teamspeak for push to talk will probably fix most of it. Ah, oh, okay. I need to find a button. To... Oh, well, the, the technical term is RPS. Yeah. Engines engaged. Simmer. Um, I think all Paying weapons have a slight aim assist. Actually, sure. even the fixed then, ones. Uh, hasn't been there for a while. They might have tweaked. Yeah, can I? I uh, actually, have any of you guys done the assassination missions yet? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> well, I, tr I tried doing one before, and it said locate a guy in Dahan. It um, wasn't. I have um, no idea how long it was. It. Um, no, but I did have one of them. Ah, it was a Mistral. It said locate. Uh, I think you just got to drop Dahan. into um, an identified signal source. Is that, is that how you do it? it? Yeah, you got to. Yeah. I dropped, I dropped into quite a few, and it didn't come up. So it just does it randomly generated. Uh, it, the moment I think it does, yeah, but what you're eventually going to have is you can kind of scan the new stores for information about, you know, this player yeah. was last season. Yeah, I was thinking it would be awesome if you could zero in on them, like go to an area, then you get a bit, you know, yeah, that, limited, that, that, that limited scope go. every time. Damn it, crash with your sequels, sequels for all information. <laughs> apologies, apologies, I'm back now. <laughs> no, no, I'm still still right in my sights here. Uh, uh, someone's getting shot. Who's, 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 who said Molly? That's for you to guess. Yeah. <laughs> I said apologies. Does that sound like money? <laughs> What's that sound? Oh, no. Yes, unfortunately, an incredibly well done dinner. So much space. I love it. I, I oh. doubt I was the first person to get to this location, but uh, i got to be in the top ten. Yeah, there was a guy from, I think it was God of War Chaos, was one of the mods on um, Reddit, he was out there a couple of days ago, I think, like day one. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to do it as soon as possible, but I was literally led up for about 48 hours, feeling awful. So I uh, just, oh, I know, I know. Yeah, I think he just started jumping and then halfway along the way was able to buy a Cobra and then jumped further. <laughs> Somehow accumulated enough money to buy a Cobra. <laughs> 
Yeah. It, I mean, tell you what, that's practically what I did. I mean, I couldn't afford the Cobra, but I went for the uh, the holder. And it was literally just through ex exploration. I was just kind of bouncing around, getting a few things. I was like, oh, wow, I've made enough money for a holder. Oh! Now. Not the ramming, boys. <laughs> and then... Uh, I used the uh, extra cash I had left over. I actually uh, upgraded the engine to a, uh, a better FSD engine and uh, increased my range. Like it it really is into a collider, okay. don't you? You're actually bumping ships. So where I'm are sure we? That's you? <laughs> I'm just grinding across his face. It's okay. I mean, What's the system in space? That's how, that's how space that's how spaceships greet one another. <laughs> Post EGX flu, yes, that's exactly what I had. Part of the mating ritual. Who's giving hints away? The world of beast. It's giving hints away. Resource collection site at 14 Hercules is amazing. Oh yeah. <laughs> I've been there yet. Thanks for that. <laughs> <laughs> there is so much. That's the problem. There is so much to do. So many places to go. So what system are we in at the moment? Oh, is that a? Azerbaijan has advanced. 570 systems for us to begin, and we're in Iran. You've got no shield blocks, what have you been doing? <laughs> in ramming <Rabbit> people. He's <laughs> 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 been greeting on the ship. Oh, collision, collision. <laughs> So, uh, Grondane in my chat here was saying they uh, found a, a special ship, the Grand Oracle. Dropped into Ooh. the session. I think that's the thing I like about it, is it's kind of semi-random at the moment. There's going to be more detail to that, obviously, but it's nice that uh, you're kind of wandering around, you don't know what you're going to find. Are you saying the universe is like a box of chocolates? You never know <laughs> what you're going to get. <laughs> jump, Forrest, jump. <laughs> ah! Oh, Max. Uh, no, oh, in nice. answer to your question, I have not been shooting people up, but that's not why the shields, shields are down. I just failed at keys. I haven't <laughs> quite got used to using the keyboard <laughs> again. <laughs> okay, so... So high I turned on silent running by mistake. <laughs> I thought the D scanner would scan a high energy wake. Yeah, I was doing that. No, so uh, you times. need an actual wake scanner. For that. Yeah, you need a special scanner. Ah, uh, so they can trail you, uh, what their yeah. Stargate address was then. Yeah, I think the low energy is just super cruise, and the high energy is hyperspace. Yeah. So then you can yeah, actually well track the systems. Very nice. Who's that trying to teabag me? Operators, guys. Mayor Mark is furiously rewriting a lot of it. <laughs> oh. uh. Okay, should we play a game of how many people could be floating around inside Stardog? Let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> request permissions, and I get shot when I get in there. I well, still need no, to don't, this thing don't it request. It's uh, last man standing. <laughs> if you fly in there without a request, you'll find yourself in deep trouble. So I, I have to um, I have to give a shout out to my friend at work who printed out. Uh, have you guys seen the uh, the Starship poster? Every single sci-fi Starship and more. Of them. Have you guys? Oh, seen that? oh yeah, yeah. I think yeah, yeah it's cool. Cool. It's mad. He printed it out in like fantastic quality A3 for me, and I need to get it up on the wall behind me. It's really really cool. It's set to scale, isn't it? Everything's to scale. Yeah, it's yeah. absolutely crazy. I mean, literally, the ships on there would be. Tiny, like the elite ships would be absolutely yeah. tiny on there. I think probably the Anaconda is the only one big enough to go on that poster. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> probably just I don't know. To a sticky index I don't know. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I'm just the at the now. Yeah, I've seen that before. Serenity is on it. Serenity, yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I yeah, did think that someone's going to do a Serenity mod for um, Elite Dangerous, so we can have the Firefly class in here. Because I don't know if you've seen, obviously, the series Firefly, but also the film Serenity. Yes. In 2005. Yes. The opening yeah. sequence where they're landing in an atmosphere. Yeah. Like, uh, oh, we're going to have a rough landing. Define rough. It says, oh god, oh god, we're all going to die. 
Sorry, blocks, no entrance. Sorry, blocks. Oh! <laughs> entrance, please. Oh, shit. Uh, Dr. Oh, Bob no, is telling me my land here. Oh, I've not had a chance to try the uh, in game well, ones much at the, the moment, but <laughs> we're in Team Street right now, yeah. Fair enough. What's on the cards tonight, stream? Well, hopefully, I'm going to meet up with the other ambassadors. That's not the first looking up last time I'm to get there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a long way away. I was just busy up there. having too much fun exploring. What's the, the game plan then? Okay? Well, hopefully, I'm going to get over to you guys as soon as I can. I'm literally trying to find a route to jump back. You just take your time, mate, no worries. I might. It's only like 100 How light years. I mean, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's not like yet to actually see anybody. Whoops. I think one day just um, upset someone. I heard yeah, that seems that way. In game. <laughs> <laughs> ah, yes, Reinhardt. Firefly Serenity. Good stuff. Yeah. That'd be quite a good chip to have as well. Nice cargo hold. No weapons. Molly, 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 Molly. Hello. No weapons, no, but uh, no, you could strap a, a, a cannon on the top, because they did that. <laughs> I did think Was so. that in the film? Yes. And then uh, I've not seen the film in a long time. It's been ages. Let's just hope we don't come across that doctor bloke. <laughs> just whisper very quietly. Miranda. Yes. You need to be quiet. Roll up stage. Roll up stage and crash on his own show. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Right, how many credits have I got? Oh my god, I've got almost 30,000. So, have I got enough oh. money to buy a ship? Eagle, maybe? A uh, I've just got into the... Is it a shipyard? A shipyard? Is it a shipyard? Yeah. And uh, there's nothing here. Either they don't have any, or they don't want to deal with me because I'm poor. I think I'm going to swing by Ibutus and buy myself a fight before uh, I meet you guys. Oh, really? <laughs> Go on. Just as you do. Does he come with a 50? Yeah, yeah, especially. Oh, uh, Elan's already in one, so, you know. How much is yeah. the Viper? Viper, uh, uh, Viper's ride. just under 100,000, I think. Got 100,000 already? You should see Elan. Uh, he's got, like, double that, at least. What? <laughs> Elam has been a naughty day. boy. Yeah, don't worry. I got Give me a week, I'll have 43 mil. <laughs> I'm, I'm wondering well, when I might get upgraded from Harmless, because I've got about 150 <laughs> kills so far in this uh, in Beta 2. You never go in. Eh? I thought it was something like 6 in the original, wasn't it? To get to I've, mostly Harmless? I was I've like played eight, for 3 months in Beta 1, and I think I had 43 kills. I just didn't do any combat at all. <laughs> yeah, it does take some getting used to. I think I killed more people by driving into them with my anaconda than I actually did by firing at them. <laughs> Died more times <laughs> leaving the station. <laughs> to be fair, I mean, uh, I... One sec, sorry. <laughs> Beta 3, did I knew? I knew there was going to be an announcement. Oh, I could buy a, a Viper from here, want. fantastic. Three, two, I have this one. Oh, I can't wait. Proof of Alright, <laughs> <laughs> AFK okay. couple just need to reherd the jewel of the beasts. Oh, okay. do please. But I think. Uh, I'm not sure that the Viper is any less viable than it was before. I think I've got exactly the same jump range. Yeah, okay, I mean, yes, you've got to spend a bit more money on e extra bits and pieces, but yeah. it still works. See, this is the thing, I mean, some of the ships now, like particularly the Cobra when you first start it, I don't think it's got the same uh, cargo capacity as it used to have. But you can upgrade it to have the same cargo capacity, so you've got to kind of look for all those, those components to improve it. So if you start off with a frame shift drive that gives you six light years, you could theoretically you can upgrade, upgrade it to one that has twice that. Yeah, which is which is what I did with the um, the yeah. hauler I got now. I had a uh, H class frame shift drive, which was not great. Um, and then I managed to upgrade it to I think it's an F class I got now, which increased my jump distance from like 11 to up to like 15, 16 light years, which was enough to get places. Yeah. 
You need about uh, sort of 14 light year jump range, and then this is without time. Yeah, well, yeah, once you get over that critical sort of range, you can do pretty much any jump, really. And it's what I'm interested in is going out into the more sparse areas of the, like the spiral arm, and you need something with a really big jump range, like an ask for the high quality FSD drive, so you can actually do those big 20, 30 light year jumps to get out into the further and further reaches. <coughs> Those hard to reach backstars. I'm sorry, Reinhardt. I love I them. I to share. Ships now, um, but I particularly enjoy it because when you buy a new ship and you put a new paint job on it, it looks fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Mine looks like it's been sandblasted. So yeah, have you noticed? That's my hull down seven percent. <laughs> but you've noticed the uh, wear and tear option though, so you can polish it up. I seem to be having a problem joining the group. Every time I accept the request and go back in, it's, it says accept again. Yeah, that, right. that go and deny the request, and then yeah. go in and request to join. Yeah, okay, I've done that. Yeah, yeah I've hit leave, and Do then that. I'll hit request oh, again. See you, Karakina. Thanks for joining well, in. We need to no, quit the game once no, accepted. Um, should need to. I'm going to quit to my menu. I think if you hit escape, friends you might be able group to management. Right, okay, your groups. LTEL, right, I'll accept you. You've been accepted. So if right, I go in now, you're an accepted. Now member. I'm in the group. Right, Woohoo! Okay. Hooray! Oh, so that's interesting. Someone no. on our chat here, Joe Crichton, just said if you get a class E jump drive in the hauler, you can get 22 light years out of it. Very oh, nice. I want, I want, I want. Mm. So that's the thing, mm. you've got to find the damn things, that's the problem. Not everywhere stops them. That's very strange. Like I think it was the um, yeah. was it Vetter or Vitor the um, system that I found this in. Drive charging. And uh, that was enough to upgrade and jump away. So I've just bought my my shiny new Viper, and it's uh, come with four uh, four ton capacity rather than eight ton. Yeah, that's yeah, that's, that's the thing. You can check the um, cargo slot like bays, and you can upgrade them to different levels. Luckily, there is a eight capacity <laughs> bit rack in this place. <laughs> there you go. You know. <laughs> well, I think that's that's quite an interesting mix because you know, I mean, all you're basically doing is getting more tightly packed racks where the cargo canisters can get slotted into. You know what I mean? And you can uh, you can mix and match them to your heart's content, really, to what you prefer your layout of your ship to be. Right now, I yeah, just I mean need to find some cannons. The Viper defaults at four ton cargo hold, but yeah. in the same space as that, you can buy an eight ton one for a thousand credits or something. It's ten thousand credits. I've been cheated. Oh, that's <laughs> interesting. The Kilbourne scanner has got um, a multi cannon icon. Oh yeah, I don't oh, think yeah. all of the icons are yeah. final yet. Yeah, it's probably a placeholder just for now. I mean, before there was the cannons didn't even have a placeholder or anything, did it? No, no. Also, have you noticed that he, you may have mentioned this already? I've just got back, but each thing's got variants. For what? For each component? Aha! Uh -huh. Yeah. So, like, yeah. overcharged lasers and things like that, is that what you mean? What sort of thing? There's that, but also, I see I mean, there's the different blocks. grades. So, you can have one Dry that charging. puts an uh, engine that puts more power out, but yeah. weighs more. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Or there's like a really expensive one that weighs the same with more power output. Okay, yeah, well, that's what, what I got. Quite mind. cool is if, if uh, when everyone's got here, if we're all docked and refueled, you can do it again. Smart E901, that is got a class F FSD jump drive. I'm not even there yet. Oreo. Dr. Bobbins on my on my chat just well. picked up on the thing. A nicely packed rack. <laughs> nice. Oh, well, you, to wear. you can Lovely buy those in the world of any dangerous. <laughs> See, I'm just scanning right. every single so I could go into the group management, friends and groups, um, while I'm in game before I could, so now I can see where everybody is. So, we've got. Uh, Oh, sorry, so is is my Brutus. PC hardware spec yeah, or my uh, ship hardware? So because that's sticks. pretty much modules over here. Crash is a one Joe. One Joe. Like a, a Middle of nowhere. London um, sushi joint. <laughs> Come in a one Joe, I have sushi. Okay. <laughs> um, I'm, yeah, I'm getting switch. closer, I'm about in the middle of the capsule at the moment. And I'm literally... 
How much fuel I need to go a little further. It's in the gooey center. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> honey and lemon. <laughs> So all your, uh, all your voices rested up now, can you all speak again? Yeah! Well, Just about. Yeah. <laughs> the funny thing was, um, I mean, I was, uh, on Sunday I was on the train back, and, I, and my voice was fine. Um, and then, um, the, that uh, evening, I, oh, I went to um, the NFL game at Wembley. Um, oh yeah. Miami versus Oakland. And the first thing I saw was my voice. It just it just went <laughs> as soon as I, as soon as I shouted once it was it but yeah and hooray go Oakland yeah that was that was about me the morning after I was like yeah this isn't gonna do good is it <laughs> and then between Tuesday and Wednesday um, within the space of twelve hours a cold just completely sideswiped me just, yeah <laughs> I know the feeling. Well, I um, managed to uh, avoid taking any support calls on the Monday, and by Tuesday my voice was fine, so I no longer sounded like I was chewing glass. <laughs> uh, Wednesday my voice got back to normal. Well, I played with a new toy on the weekend, on the still of the Beta 1. Uh, was it the Beta 2.01? I can't remember. Uh, that was the Beta 1 on the weekend, wasn't it? Still, it's true days now, it's terrible. I'm, I'm, I'm going to throw this question out to you guys, Stephen Usher there. Was EGX more intense than the previous two shows? What do you guys think? Do you think it was more intense than the previous two shows? <laughs> well, we no idea. Yeah. I was at EGX last year, but not as a... Oh, what do you mean? Uh, as a, you know, stand, I was a, a, a punter going round. Um, I would say that actually there were probably more interesting games this year. Yeah, yeah um, and I think there was a much more of a buzz. Mm. Last year, the games they were showing off for Battlefield 4, which most people had already played the beta if they were keen on Battlefield anyway by that yeah. point. And Destiny. Um, Dying Light. Which means it's been in beta for the last, yeah. a, last year, isn't it? Um, <laughs> and <laughs> what was the other big game? Oh, Titanfall. Um, oh, Titanfall. Of course, everyone was desperate to buy an Xbox One with Titanfall. Yeah. You know, as a sort of a free, as a pre-order. Um, so the big games really kind of were Battlefield, Titanfall, Dying Light, and Watch Dogs. Um, yeah. And of course, Watch Dogs didn't show up until much later because there had so many problems; it got delayed. Um, but I don't, I don't recall it being quite as busy. I think each year it's getting more sort of um, popular. I think. Yeah. Obviously, they're losing the venue um, of uh, Ells Court next year, so they're going to have to go up to the okay. NEC in Birmingham. Oh, oh, no, I heard about that, yeah. Which yeah. means I've then got the added cost of having a four and a half hour drive up there in a hotel overnight if I really want to spend a day up there. <laughs> do, do you know if it's definitely at uh, NEC in Birmingham? Yes, they've Is sent it? an okay. email uh, through. It up, um, yeah. Also, it's been in the, um, uh, the, the, the show Sorry. press, M uh, M MCV. Um, newsletter. So the well, that's a little annoying. Oh, well, yeah. why did I'm going to miss Old Court. That's that's really sad, actually. I mean, well, I'm sure the rest of the country won't be that bothered. Well, they wouldn't <laughs> let Boris go to Casey Island, so he's knocking down Old Court. I have spy. That's right. Boris is going to be representing my bloody uh, constituency next year as well. Nice switch in South Rise Lip. That's not that's not fun. Like, I well, think I can, can't. I can honestly say, changed. guys, that that was the most intense show I've done, so uh, you definitely had a baptism of fire there, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll sit outside Azaban. You guys, you guys here as well? Well, I'm, yeah. I'm kind of docked in Azaban, waiting for everyone else to arrive, because what I was going to do was then undock ready to launch. I thought it would be quite funny to have us all launch on mass. Well, yeah. yeah, let's all go and land if we're outside, and then all launch at the same time. I see Glendane. Like, I see Glendane. We can all be like go for the well, exit at the same time. <laughs> well, I, I'm set up with Shadowplay to record what's going on in game, so it would be quite cool if I launch first and then fly to the back of the station. I can then sort of record all of us taking off and then follow all the others out. I see El Tel, okay. he's hovering around. Oh, good. Yep, I finally got in. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I will just check just inside the station. Drive. Back in. You disconnect. Yeah. Oh, request denied. Maybe, maybe as a man would be kind denied. to me and fight, give me some cannons. Come on. We're going to get that. Yeah, if you try and fly in and get a trespass oh. notice before okay. you request permission to land, you won't get permission to land for about 10 seconds. I got in the second attempt. Yes, but... Got you. Don't do it again. 
So that's an interesting thing actually, Simra's just uh, asked in the chat here about uh, a, having a screen to check out your ship hardware. You have got the one on the right, but it doesn't have all the detail in there. Um, but I don't know if you guys have noticed, when you're upgrading the modules to various elements, you can actually uh, get like a compare option, have you seen that? Uh, yes, I've no, seen yep. I haven't seen that well, yet. Well. I've been too brastic to actually buy anything, so till I've got some cash in my pocket, there's no point staring at the upgrades I can't find. It's for like trying to buy a sighting joystick. You look at it and go, if only I just, uh, just window shopping. Just window shopping. <laughs> just window shopping, yeah. 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 Yeah, is there a way to see everything that's in the shop, or have you just got to click through? You, well, you can you can click through each one. Once you find something in a slot, you can uh, there's a compare button to compare it to your current hardware in that slot, but uh, not like an overall one at the moment. Yeah, okay. I foresee a website coming up. I'm going to give you the full breakdown. Ah, that's bad. There's no weapons. There's no shields either. I am barely out of I'm going to have to stop the... Stop the fuel up. Shoot. I have to reverse it. Nice thing going on. Main fuel tank low. Oh. Yeah. Main fuel tank low. We're not going to do Well, nads. Where am I going to find cannons? Ah, oh, Celus. Good idea. A Celus. I'm getting that closer. Place. That's, that's close. I'll just well, Crash is in LHS, so he's kind of somewhere in the same galaxy. Yeah, I'm having a few yeah. drops on there. I'm, um, we're all somewhere in the same galaxy. Systems, I can't jump <laughs> into the same galaxy. That's the problem with those systems. So. I did go for a little exploration last night to the other end of the what I call the lozenge of discovery, and um, I got lost and I couldn't find my way back. <laughs> <laughs> lozenge of discovery. And I got right to the edge, and then I, th I kept going around in circles. <laughs> Yeah, I agree. With you. Um, got Nam three in my chat here saying that the uh, the stand was good. I think it it was awesome, wasn't it? The, uh, mm. the dangerous stand. Yeah, it was nothing yeah, like right. I was expecting. I mean, I was expecting just like a row of computers. You know how you <laughs> see those sort of small yeah. small time little booths that like just rows of computers with a, a nice little part partition wall type thing. Um, but it completely blew me away. Yeah, when we I, got there the, uh, on I saw some of the concepts, but uh, to see it all put together, it was like, oh, this just looks so cool. It was, like, it was the best stand. I think simply yeah. from the I mean, point you of view of win an award when you have people yeah. queuing round, they were looking at the game the whole time. Whereas if you went at any other stand, most of them either very dark, kind of like a back game, or because of the certification of the game, mm. they were all boxed in. Boxed so it was yeah, yeah there was a lot of boxing in this year. Yeah. Oh, is that what uh, it was for? Games? Yeah, because the games Rating. were like 5x4 yeah. and uh, uh, things like that, they were boxed in, so the youngsters were yeah. like yeah. yeah. a yeah. child. Yeah. Yeah. I think it was also to stop people recording it as well, because there was a lot of that issue as well, of yeah. people not being able I, to record. I, I, that, that was the great thing about the Elite Danger Stand, it was like, you know, it was completely in the open, it was like, yeah, take pictures, take video, yeah. do what you want. Yeah. Well, I don't, I don't yeah. understand the idea of taking your game to the biggest public, like, <laughs> and <laughs> saying, like, don't show away. anyone. Don't yeah, I mean that's that's what we had um, last year when I saw Watch Dogs. I had to go into a separate room to do the presentation. Yeah. That's right. Like, yeah, they, they had like a little it. viewing booth, but didn't they? <laughs> I think yeah. it's to do with the the distributors. They don't want anyone kind of releasing anything because they were promised an exclusive. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 And, and they all have like um, they all have media so embargoes as well and all that kind of stuff yeah. they, these days. Oh, terrified someone will give them a truthful review. I mean, a bad review <laughs> when the game's released. <laughs> there, there are no weapons available at Azaban City. As I just described, it's been, it's been so I'm, I'm headed to a us. It's the centre of pacifism in the universe. You can't buy any guns here. It's after the Civil War, isn't it? Yeah, they've, there's none left. They're all gone. They've a lovely forest, though. It's, um, <laughs> it's unusual for a communi uh, communist uh, place. So I've got I've got a request from Ambassador Reinhardt here that uh, I, I I don't think I can fulfil myself, but I will pass it on to the right people. We want an Elite Dangerous Soon TM T-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Could you trademark the word "soon"? <laughs> trademark it. We Not can have a go. Up. We can have a go. I think I should trademark. Um, that's what it's in the chat. Hi Ed. I think. Definitely have one that says oh, Elite Dangerous Ed Beta in. than the rest. No, <laughs> no, you can't hear me, Ed. Go away. You don't deserve to hear my voice. Ah, Ed, Ed is Ed. on the channel. Greetings. Oh, Could you probably keep it down between Ed. five and ten oh, minutes? Can we? Can we shoot him? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on, Ed. Ed, <laughs> Ed I think it's time for your break, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, did you just sleep in the office at the moment? <laughs> Yeah, you, you've got to go home at some point, Ed. You mm. can't stay there all the time, you know. <laughs>
think they keep him on chains. You know the film Back to the Future? That He's the eating pizza. He turns up with a DeLorean <laughs> and it's powered by Mr. Fusion, which is like this tube, and he happens to tip some rubbish in there and it kind of powers the react nuclear reactor. Well, I think they've got a whole bunch of programmers lined up at, uh, at Frontier, <laughs> and they're basically organised in the same way, but they just pour in pizza and coffee. Just pizza you know, and eggs come cookies. More and, more and, Millie's cookies. <laughs> and Millie's cookies, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Millie's cookies. <laughs> Now, I, I think Michael just got them for himself, to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> they did look fine, though. They did look mighty fine. Oh, yeah, I'm a sucker for cookies. I'll, I'll do anything for cookies. This is, this is mean, because I've given up sugar. So, you know, people oh. talk about sort of chocolate and cookies and stuff. I'm like, but I really like those. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, have another sugar free polo some. and suffer in silence. Oh. <clears throat> hey, re re reply to my email, Ed. I, I don't care if you're on work hours. Get on it. <laughs> no excuse, Ed. No excuse. Yeah, yeah we'll I'll um, patch notes for 205 for you to uh, for you to type up there. So uh, you know, whenever you're ready. Ah, oh, you guys, no, no rest, no rest. <laughs> <laughs> All right, summary. I'll just show you the compare option as soon as I get back to the menu. And then when the uh, next beta coming out, I've been waiting ages for an update, mate. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh man. Yeah. Two point zero five. See, it's taking forever <laughs> releasing these updates. It's ridiculous. Uh, I mean, basically, I so I have a you know a play of elite sort of you know breakfast, and then by tea time, there's another version. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's like just you know. Have a meal, have another version. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all this juicy exploration. I, I got over 24,000 credits in exploration data, and I'm not even back yet. Mm. Nice. nice, it's worth it. Right, I'm just well, going to go nice. through this uh, egg fitting options. I haven't really gone down the exp exploration route yet. Um, no, it's, no, it's no, I'm likely to now, I'm in the Viper. It's really, really <laughs> simple, and it was just, I kind of like did it by accident and realised that, yeah, you jump into a system uh, and it just comes up, ooh, new astronomical object discovered, uh, and it's usually the star, and then you, you can just turn and scan the star. I mean, and I think I'd, I, um, I, I scan yeah. sticks because, just for my own benefit, because I couldn't be bothered to have unknown appear all the time. But um, other than that, I really haven't done much with it. Mm. So this applied just to the star, or any other place <gasps> inside the uh, planetary kind of range of any given star system? Well, if it's a stellar body, you can scan it. Yeah, anything, planets, stars, whatever. Um, you can. I think the discovery skin. Uh, excuse me. What? <laughs> I think the discovery scanner gives an overall like a. An outline of the planet, while a surface scan gives a really detailed um, feedback on the planet and its yep. makeup. It's basically uh, speculate to accumulate, spend that money to, to get I mean, that scanner. As soon as you jump into a system, you get that instant. Oh, I've discovered a body, sort of thing. So you get that kind of like, yes, you know, there's something there, but you haven't actually done a, a discovery scan on it. Once you do that, you know its name, you know its composition, and like the basic things about it. Um, you can buy that then crazy expensive discovery scanner. I'm going to see if I can find it. Um, yeah, here we go. Uh, nope, I haven't got one here. But yeah, I think yeah, it, last time I saw it was something like 300,000 credits for like the advanced scanner. Which is insane. It's so expensive. Yeah, Blackley mentions uh, that he's not entirely convinced that the ranks are working yet. I, I'd like to second that query. Yeah, I think... Um, yeah, I think right. 6,161 kills, and my rank is still harmless. Yeah, but it's only going to be counting counting from beta yeah. to... So, I mean, I've got like 100 from in beta to alone, so... Ooh, guys, I'm going to give you a shout-out on Ed's request, so we know everyone who's on the line. So we'll go from the top again, yeah? Go for it. Yep. Okay, we got Arathon. That's me. we got Commander Blocks. Yep, I'm here. We got Altal. Hello. Elan. Hello, hello. Grimmy. Howdy. Some bloke called Crash. Max Ursa. Aloha. Moly. Hi, I'm Ed's adopted child. <laughs> <laughs> and Tetrick. Small <laughs> <Little> child. <laughs> Backstairs thing. So, so we, we've, got a, we've got a vast chunk of the EGX ambassadors here with us today. All the surviving well, arms, anyway. yeah, the ones yeah, that, the ones that, that survived the onslaught. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, the ones that didn't get sent home in a ambulance. <laughs> right, I am close. LHS two eighty four. Where are you guys? 
Uh, I spent city at around it. Right, I'm two jumps from Dahar. Oh, All right, oh, so I've got my cannon. Three jumps cannons back now, which is very nice indeed. Where were they? I think I've got to go and buy some. They're in as uh, uh, sellers. Are you buying that? Oh, Ryan's in chat. Look at him. He's up. He's not here. He's upset. He's oh, alone. poor Ryan. Why are you not here, Ryan, baby? Hope you feel better soon, Ryan. Uh, yeah, let's really know. Oh, he for a patch. Uh, yeah. There was yeah. an update. He's of the HUD and the GUI. You can uh, go into the options menu and stop so. some of the flicker and things <laughs> yeah. like that. If it uh, gives you a headache. Ryan, where are you? Type it in the chat. We, we're going to have to invite Ambassador uh, Abacus because he's, uh, he's he's an ambassador. He needs to be on the chat. We need a yeah, permanent uh, ambassador clubhouse, I think. Dr. Wookie was the ambassador, wasn't he? E3. Yes. And yes. Make it so exclusive ambassador group. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I want an insignia in game. That's, that'd be brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Thought it's it out, too Ed. much, maybe. <laughs> Nothing's too much for Ed. Right. Erin, did you say, yeah? If anyone can make it happen, Ed can make it happen. <laughs> Ed's the man. I think if Ed can survive the last two weeks, he can survive anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what an introduction to your new job, eh? <laughs> I did a great job. Yeah, I saw Ed's thousand yard stare. Like, oh my god, people, breaks, yes. <laughs> Have a t-shirt. And here's a pen. <laughs> go, go, go! <laughs> Throttle up. That's why he bailed them. Uh, it's not so much multitask. It's just avoiding a brain sort of embolism, really. <laughs> Very well, Commander Crowley. See you later. Brain group, right. Crowley's okay, just heading off, so thanks to all you guys for putting up and chatting at EGX. Warning. Critical. No problem, Crowley. Right, one hop from Aaron in. I'm I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I've been saying that for the last time. I can see Max in Super Cruise here. Cool day. I've left it a bit late, but I'm just popping off to Acellus Primus to buy some weapons. Go for it. That's where I've just been. <laughs> nice high tech. Do they, do I don't they have any weapons, weapons for 999 nine, nine credits? What is this weapon slot? There's, there's a perfectly good hull here that I can use. Well, I sold it <laughs> when I went exploring yesterday. Uh, yes. still, got the, still got the standard sidewinder. Well, as I sold them, I gave away my freeload. I did uh, come across a system, I can't remember what it was called, but it was designated as high tech. I don't think there were any space stations there. <laughs> I suppose I should report that. Very high-tech yeah. indeed, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Invisible. Stealth. Uh, stealth, yeah. That's right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I had an Orbis and it ran away. It's possible. Maybe it was an Acellus that was there, but it's not anymore. I don't know if you guys... Can you guys see my chat? I don't think you've got it open, have you? Uh, I do. I have. Yeah. Oh, right. I was just, yeah, just going to say that uh, Ed was... Uh, Said it was his most favourite weeks of his life, and we were a pleasure to work with. So obviously he was drinking way too oh, much. Brilliant. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. yeah. yeah. Well, well, don't say it's wrong. Way. That's been a kiss ass. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys in uh, Asban City? No, yeah. I'm now heading I'm towards Beagle too. I, I'm I'm heading towards Asban City. Right. Okay. Uh, Phil, yeah, no, depends there. how much you like to have shields and stuff like that. You can sacrifice shields and other That's stuff to maximise your cargo in the Sidewinder. You could yeah. also get rid of the um, Discovery Scanner, couldn't you? So I you think so. I mean, it's one point three tons, but yeah. it does it doesn't give you any more space, but um, makes your ship a little bit lighter. Increase that. No, range. I think I traded my Discovery Scanner for an extra cargo. Did you do that? Was that, was that the Eagle though? And that was the one that yeah. you could access. I think the Eagle was a little bit strange. Yeah. Like I upped its cut because its default is two. I upped it to four. However, I could still only scoop two. Hmm. <laughs> I got yeah, a list of bugs I need to report, but I just haven't quite got around to it. <laughs> I've got like six. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's the worst thing, isn't it? It's like, it's like oh, that's that's probably. A oh, hang on, I've got to get here first. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Just just one one more one more trade run. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> just yeah. <laughs> testing way too much to be able to report all the bugs. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Too busy uh, testing. Yeah. testing. We're we're not playing for enjoyment at all. We're, we're definitely hardcore testers. Yes, so absolutely. We are. Testing testing to the end. True. Nothing to do with thoroughly enjoying it. <laughs> <laughs> 
getting no enjoyment from this whatsoever. <laughs> No. I actually I hate this game, I just play it. <laughs> <laughs> we just we just make you. We just so make you. Right. I play it so no one's around. Me off. <laughs> give me a backhander. <laughs> no one around <laughs> I think we're all docked at Erin in waiting oh, yeah, for all uh, ah. crash. I I I'm about hang on, three megameters, hang on, hang on, I'm coming. I'm just hanging outside um Azmet City, so I guess I'll just beat you out here. Ed's yeah, shouting I'm at us now, we've got to fill those tickets <laughs> out. Come on. Get to it guys, fill those tickets out. <laughs> Ed said. I accidentally went to the uh, Azerban Orbital instead of uh, City. <coughs> wop, wop. Oh, yeah, yeah. Crash gets to Azerban, we're all going to launch and go there and shoot. Yeah, that's what Crash. <laughs> that's, <genius. laughs> yeah. that's what Grandin just said is like, as soon as I come through the uh, airlock, there's just going to be this blaze of blaze of fire. Like, <laughs> <laughs> You'll think it was a space station. <laughs> it's like, what happened? What happened? Quad Cannon Viper. <laughs> Yeah. Got a warm welcome. <laughs> First wave of lasers, second wave of cannons. Ah, <laughs> oh, I know, I know you guys love me. Final really. wave, we should be ramming. <laughs> ah, yeah, Commander Sura, he's online. He's yeah. gonna be there soon. <laughs> Just use the texture. There we go. All right, so I see you've just jumped in. Oh, can you see me? But I don't no. see you. <laughs> Wait, is that you flying across? No, that's someone's getting shot. I just got a really large. That's not me. That's not me. That's Richie Biscuits, apparently. Right. So, Elon, Moly, me. Oh, I can see one of you guys in a visor. Who's that? It's Grimmy. Hey! I got Grimmy. There you are. I don't see you. Either. I'm in a bog stand. Don't let him get in the station. Oh, I see you here, I think. The transit oh, bag. Rush, get in the station. No, I'm just uh, undocking. Deploying cannons. I'm, I'm just relogging. <coughs> this is interesting because I've got. Um, I'm on the landing pad directly below the entrance, or in fact, directly above. Oh, you just come. Oops. There's a hauler just driven in the <laughs> here. Is that you? Yeah, I think I need a better scanner. No, you're still outside. Or are you? Is that just lag on the video? Whoopsie. That's kind of embarrassing. Yeah, it's 20 seconds lag on the video. <gasps> oh, in that case, the hauler I'm looking at must be Crash. Whoopsie. Just, oh, just let me come back outside and ask for a clearance. Rookie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> 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 I was literally, I was just reading the chat and I was just kind of like in the corner of my eye just going through the port and see what they go. Ah, I know what it was, it's because I had Grimmy selected and I was just like click, 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 request docking. Yeah, that's almost like being asked to dock for some woman wearing an Oculus Rift. <laughs> While she's wearing the Oculus Rift and staring at the window. Yeah, yeah, sure, yeah, that's that's, that's, that's fine, Mike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'll, I'll, I'll dock that. <laughs> I'm not the hauler you're looking for. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I see you. Yeah, yeah, my, yeah, my scanner's not very good, it's not really picking up very much. <coughs> no, correct, <laughs> to see. Move along. I've got I'm no one on my scanner anymore. I think, well, I I think actually when you dock, you risk being launched back into a different instance, even if we're in the same... Do you, Koresh? <laughs> <laughs> I got this, got this eerie voice in my head, and I can say, oh, these ships just kind of hovering around you. Right. No! Now kiss. <laughs> <laughs> well, these weapons are very expensive. <laughs> yeah, they, they definitely uh, oh, had a I've bit of a price on I'm off. Press denied. Okay. Yeah, class 4 cannons, or what were class 4 cannons, they're now class 2, are like 160 grand. A piece. Okay, oh, I've just sold my black leaves, naughty, spreading rumors. Whoop! Did you see that in the chat? Gosh, where are you going? I was just gonna dock. I thought that's what we were doing. We you just zoomed, like, you, it must have been like a bit of a lag spike there. Your angle's cheeky. So Blacklist saying, like, I wonder if there are any secret missions from when your reputation with a faction is high. Watching which which in other words means Blackley knows that there's uh, secret things <laughs> hidden there. <laughs> Have you got no shields, Max? You just oh. went through a building, yeah. Ah, I've got shields. Oh, that's strange. Huh. 
I think my, my scanner might, must be just I'm not, I'm useless. Not. I was given crash an extreme close up in my Kaga hatch. You give him a little kiss. <laughs> Speed hit. Give him a little cheeky peck. <laughs> I, can, I can drop back in the sidey just for fun. I wonder if I should do that. Why not? I, I, can always, I can always make the money again. Back in one. The station is dock blocking me. <laughs> <laughs> ah, greetings, Commander and Topica. It's not allowing you into its slot. Is that is that how it is? No. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, darling. <laughs> Who's <Come in. laughs> breathing heavily? It's freaking. <laughs> <laughs> is that Darth? So I'm just going to check how much this stuff is worth. Would you do that, Blackly? Uh, yes, probably. <laughs> I don't trust you as far as I can debug you. <laughs> yes, how very odd. It's saying that you don't have any shields on my screen. That's oh, you're underneath me. Hello. 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 He's all in, in his Viper there. there. Appears to be a bug with the ship buying thing at the moment. Yeah, what, where oh. are you, Karash? Are you in the station? I am docked. I just wanted to see how much this uh, exploration because data I've gathered oh. is going to be. Well, there's a Commander Karash flying around. Oh, I see you. I keep ramming. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, almost, I almost hit the spike. You know when you dock at the have a uh, docking pad at the end of the space station? There's a oh, spike. The oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm Wait, Commander Crash isn't Crash. I'm com I'm com Is there another crash? Someone's stealing my name. Uh -oh. oh, I'm ramming into them at the front of the station. <laughs> who's who's giggling? Definitely not me. Moi. <laughs> Why, why have you got your cargo hatch open? Me? Nom nom nom. Uh, it's Max. <laughs> Richie, oh, who's the Commander Karash, Karash, Karash then? No, got... Not me. Give me a name. Give me a name. Oh, look at all this juicy data I can see. I can see. I can see Max and Arathon. And that's all I can see. Um, <laughs> We've got online Karash. Yarp. Oh, wait. Arathon. Oh, oh, I did just see someone else. I see the groomy. So. I definitely need a better scanner for this. Good. 4,000 credits for one system? That's, this is where the money's at, guys. Get out and explore. Oh, there is. I, uh, I beg to differ. Oh, really? With uh, with bounties such as 30 grand, I mean, it's difficult True. not to go down the combat route. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I've, I've fully kitted out two different ships so far, so... And I've not done a single trading cargo. cargo. Yeah, that's the thing. Cargo. <laughs> Who needs cargo? I think Except for the people's cargo. Well, yeah, true. <laughs> well, in the Eagle, you can't. Well, I couldn't scoop more than two. But then, when I got back to sell it at the black market, I wasn't actually able to sell it. So there was no point in having any cargo hold at all. <laughs> Now I'm sending a document question and I'm not getting a reply back. Don't seem to have that issue with the Viper though, fortunately. Let's restart. I just got DC'd guys, so I'm just going to try restart. Oh, moly. Oh, I didn't have you Didn't have you on my scanner. Oh. I can't be uh, Can't be touching someone unknown. I mean, <laughs> Go on. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, your ship's <laughs> filthy. Yeah, it's the way I like it. <laughs> Blackly, there's a good lord. Look at that friends list. Yeah, it's difficult to manage. <laughs> Who else is out and about here? I think I need to put a, a bug report in for a uh, better friends management. Proceed to landing pad for those sounds. <laughs> it's in here somewhere. <laughs> So is everybody still around Azavan City? Yep. Yeah. yeah. We're, just we're just grinding against each other. 
Frotter Stop dancing it. Stop around. It. Isn't that called Frotter? I'm, I'm gonna have to go <laughs> wash myself now. <laughs> <laughs> Just at the thought. I thought, oh, hello. I hope I'm you're not Moli, taking my paint And then I thought you were enjoying it a little bit too much, so <laughs> I decided to back off. Right. So I'm worried that you might be taking my paint off, so now I'm going to back away from you. Have no oh. food. <laughs> Because it's in a state of war right now. Yeah, you actually lose your paint job if I do this too. I assume. Times. Possibly, I don't know. That'd be awesome. I'm struggling to get back in there, guys, unfortunately. What I know is it doesn't take much for the paint job to be lost. <laughs> so, uh, I wonder what's going to happen in uh, what's coming in Beta 3. Ooh, I saw Sarath just then. Beta 3! It's exciting. Okay, it's your song for it. Beta 3. We're, we're not even going to have a chance be to get used to Beta 2 and then we're going to have Beta 3. It's insane. I should is. say, it had better be mining. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> I, I think that should be ready by then. I was, it was like nearly ready for this, but uh, it didn't I'll tell you what I'd like to see in Beta 3, and that would be things like shipyards and uh, oh, well, like, star, like star bases under things. construction. Yeah. yeah. So, like an outpost with a Corolla station half built next to it, you know? <laughs> it's it's yeah, coming. It's good. coming. And the Freegal. <laughs> Soon TM. You know, like a big shipyard building loads and loads of capital ships. You could just kind of fly by and, you know, supply beer to the workers or something. Yeah. Yeah. Commander Blocks, I see you. Hello. Yes, hello there. There's a Blackly just come up with a suggestion <laughs> actually at the moment. Yeah, Commander Gondor. Your own ship that's uh, shown on there. And Eltel is out and about yeah, as well. That's quite a selection of weapons that Commander Grundane has. <laughs> Railgun, multi cannon. Oh no, it's two multi cannons, but different class multi cannons. Yes. Did they fix the docking computer? Is it, is it, have any of you guys bought a docking computer yet? <laughs> Not at all. Uh, Damn. No, why? I, I bought one. Bought one in beta 106, but it was. Oh, sorry, no, it was 103 then. And uh, but I haven't had one since. That's I think yeah. I used it once. Automated crashing computer. I quite I enjoyed the music. <laughs> I, it's I quite really enjoy crashing into uh, the AI. I, I said to the the frontier guys that I thought they should keep it. And, and when they do a better version, make that the Mark II. So go, oh yeah, I had the Mark One docking computer, and it was really terrible. So I had to buy a better one. You know, just leave that in as a feature of the game. You know, everyone knows that the Mark Ones are the cheapest, but they're just so terrible. You know, you, you, you just don't use it very long. Yeah, so yeah. I would discourage everyone from using it. So it's like, oh, just dock manually. I know how to do it. Then. <laughs> the AI are certainly docking a lot more intelligently these days. Oh yeah, I agree. Yeah. I saw so I saw an AI go straight to its pad. Which is completely it's like new to me. Flip sort of vertically and then travel at a 15 degree angle. No, not at all. <laughs> went, went straight to it. Well, they used wow. to be able to park in premium beta, so I think it was just with the advent of the docking computer they've all given yeah. docking yeah. computer intelligence. Yeah. All the lack thereof. Indeed. <laughs> <laughs> I heard someone say that Arcturus is accessible, is that correct? I haven't been there. Yeah, I've been there. Mm. I've been there, it's a huge star. Oh yeah, it's massive, absolutely that's huge, it's a red giant. That's one of the places I actually kind of want to visit, because it's one of the one of the stars that I actually know. <laughs> From, yeah, because yeah, it was in the, the Frontier League 2, wasn't it? Oh, not, yeah. not that, I just mean in, in my general knowledge of stars. Oh, <laughs> right, that's what I mean, sorry, yeah. When I got lost yesterday, was when I found my way back to Arcturus, is I knew that I'd sort of found the route, because I could remember it on the way out, and I thought, ah, I've been here before. Yeah. It sort of stands out a bit because of its size. Well, someone in the chat earlier accused me of having uh, the entire map printed out, and I study it in the sleep. <laughs> <laughs> How did they find out? Uh, yeah, yeah, too well. yeah, they, 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 they must be watching me, so it's on my green screen. <laughs> Right, let's see if I can buy myself a sidey. Come on. You recorded yourself uh, talking out a specific route <laughs> yeah, and then uh, listen to it on repeat overnight. Ross 10, 15, Al HD. Last time I printed out a map of a game was um, Citadel on the BBC Micro in about oh, 96. Excellent. Had each <laughs> screenshot. Each time we got into a map, a screen printed out and stick up the wall until we had a giant map on the wall. <laughs> Couldn't complete the game, and then my brother came along and he was four years old and he sat down and just jumped through a hole in the wall. Like, oh, you no. can't do that. He didn't, found the secret levels. So. 
<laughs> I tried to map Jet Set Willy once. Oh, well, I, I did map it, but drew it all by hand though. Oh, I, I love it. Yeah, that. you couldn't really do sort of. Well, you could do screen prints with the Spectrum, couldn't you? I remember someone, uh, my aunt had one with a thermal printer. Oh, oh yeah. God, the toilet paper. Yeah, yeah. The yeah. Thing, yeah. <laughs> because she put it near a coffee and it'd all go brown. Oh, God, yeah. They weren't great. I remember they said Willy is thinking it was the most rude game I've ever heard of. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, how could they release games like this? <laughs> Yeah, my my mother wasn't too happy when my dad brought that home from the supermarket, and I was like, uh, "You can't let him play that game." You probably haven't played on the PC then. Back in the early nineties, Rex Nebula and the Cosmic Gender Bender. I bring from <laughs> Val. Probably not. <laughs> yeah, that was that was quite interesting. Right, I'm gonna head back out. Why is Ed Why is Ed abusing me in the chat? I'm actually at the combat zone. <laughs> Ooh, combat zone. Should we head over to the combat zone? I mean, I got the base oh. on the so I'm not bothered. If where? You, where? Let me know. I'm actually frozen in station. I might have to uh, quit out. Isn't it just scene. just uh, off just off the planet? You can zoom around oh, the planet no, okay. and you'll find the um, signal source for it. <laughs> Isn't it? It's Aaron in two, is it not? No, there's one actually out of the band. I think you guys all know the answer to this question. You've got Kang Kangarek on the uh, chat here. Is is the game already out? Uh, <laughs> the answer <laughs> is you could buy it now. DM. Yes, oh, that should be a knee-jerk really reaction hey, soon. Whoops. DM. <laughs> there's a very large. Star. Sadly, you're not one of them. Yeah. Yeah. That's right. So if the game is in beta, those people who have bought into the beta or backed the Kickstarter to the level of the beta uh, have it now. Okay. Otherwise, you can pre order the game and it will be out before the end of the year. That's the official line, is it not? Yep. And if you pre order, you get the mercenary pack. Yep. Yes. A you can pre order the mercenary pack for £35. It's, 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 for, it's for taking it's out the now. Weekends. It's almost like you guys are like yeah. practicing this speech for, for a week, you know? <laughs> 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 Just saying yeah. it over and over, you know? <laughs> yeah. Quick spiel is, take £35 now, get the mercenary pack in the pre-order for the release. If you wait till after release, it will be £40. <laughs> you can currently pay in oh, yeah. £15 on your pre-order and get beta access. Oh really? Well, what's included in beta access? <laughs> Please tell <something>. me. <laughs> Everything <laughs> that there is so far. I actually started, I mean, I remember dreaming, citing those lines in my head <laughs> when I was asleep. <laughs> yeah, it, it kept is. me awake. <laughs> that, was, that was the worst thing, is I couldn't actually get any sleep. Just lying, well, the best man. way to get a free seat on the train is to explain it to everyone around you. <laughs> <laughs> I just, I just, I just relax, really put my bag down the other seat, put the feet out, I can go to sleep. When I was on the train. train. When I was on the tube on the way to EGX every morning with my Elite Dangerous Ambassador t-shirt and I was wearing a rucksack which was covering it up at the back mm, and I kept yeah. wanting to take my rucksack off so that I could have the name of the game on the back. So, <laughs> where, where are we heading? To the conflict zone that's just outside Azvan City? Is it the high intensity one, yeah? Yeah. Right. Oh, oh, high intensity. Okay. Which wow. side There's enough of taking? us. Wait, 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 wait. Flip a coin. <laughs> I'm on the rebel oh. side. I don't know. I don't think I can do anything other than... Uh, I've in, I'm afraid. Yeah. <laughs> After our efforts at the Federal Valley Point, that's right. there's no other way to go. So yeah. we're looking at conflict zone, high intensity. High intensity, yeah. Yeah. I, don't think, going... I don't think I could be siding with the feds. <laughs> we all go in here and with the feds. <laughs> so it's nice to know feds. Yeah. Watch out, it's the feds. <laughs> there's uh, the government, Iranian government versus the rebels. There's no actual feds here. Oh, right, of course, yeah. Oh, okay, so man. Mm. Let's go so we have to pick a side, don't we, when we get there? So the rebels are actually on the side of the feds. Yes. Are they? Okay. okay. Wow. Things change. I think so this, this, was, this was all happening while we were at EGX, wasn't it? I think where the rebellion started and all that yes, kind of stuff. Yes, it was all being mixed up in there. 
But that's what I like. I mean, it's like there's no kind of official story in the sense of a traditional game. It's something which has kind of been constantly added to and tweaked and poked around with. And, you know, someone at Frontier comes up with a crazy idea to start a war or a famine or something like that. It just gets poked into the game. Next thing we know, it's uh, it's all change and the stock market's going to chaos and everything descends into madness. And I love that because it's so unpredictable. So sorry, what side are we going for? Erinin? Erinin in conflict of high intensity. Oh. Oh, oh, it's like the great iPhone uh, war of yes, 30, you still get a free 20. <laughs> I hope you're going for high intensity because that's where I'm heading. I don't want to bend there on my own. That's where okay. I'm at right now. Right. Can we just repeat that because I was zoning out? <laughs> <laughs> I think I got you, but in case I didn't just say it again, I wasn't listening. Erin in Erin people's in party. Erin in what? Erin in... Conflict zone, high intensity. Conflict I am fighting for the federal bridge. The federal I am on front. my way. Wait. That was strange. Uh, I hit the... Everyone uh, people's path to the path through, but then it just says shields offline, but my shields aren't offline. Uh, I got that before as well. Yeah, yeah, I get that. And then it pops up atmosphere restored as well. Yeah, like, like that. Oh, I think the aliens are <laughs> there. I think Altal actually we're getting some echo back off you, mate. I'm sorry. Pretty sure it is. Push to talk. Yeah, that's the answer. Yeah, that's fixed it. Sorry, mate. <laughs> right. Oh. I just have it. So which so side are we going for? <clears throat> the Judean People's Front. People's Front. Yeah, the People's Front, front of Judea. Judea. Uh, is that better? Yes. That's cool. Just, oh. just turn the volume. Yeah, I think that's all it was. I think it, we were all hearing ourselves again. <laughs> right. Oh, for the there's a the red sidewinder. Okay, are we in the people's party? Yeah. Oh, am I? Spy. So I've got a question here what from Blackley, guys. You know this. I'm in the federal something. Do I'm the Kickstarter backers get the mercenary eagle? Yes. 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 At what yes. levels? Um, well, if you back the game to the point you get a digital copy, you will get, by virtue of um, getting the beta, um, yeah, you get the uh, nice package. Package. Oh, so I seem to have joined the opposite side. side. Take him out. Don't go Take him out. You won't get it, I don't think. Ah, uh -oh. I trained you well, young Jedi. Right. <sighs> might want to uh, switch sides, back. No, you might want to take him <laughs> out. <laughs> oh, you hit the wrong side. Charging. There he is. Quick cruise out and back in again. Zap Hi, Max! Oh, oh dear. <laughs> yeah. I didn't get my shot off on him though, I'm well sad. That's what she said. <laughs> Blocks. Is <laughs> <laughs> this not fair? Like, you guys are in what? Vipers? Tooled up. Yeah. I'm in the free side. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. I'm in a sidewinder with really puny weapons. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Me too. Warfare in love and war. Oh man, so much rubber banding going on right now. What term um, side should we actually be joining? The winning one? People's. <laughs> the people's oh, party. I joined the opposite side, that's why everyone was red. That's why I jumped straight that out. Is <laughs> I'm supposed to be on the federal side. <laughs> right, let's get in there and take it back in again. Yes, I think the next port of call for my Viper is to upgrade the sensors for definite, because most things are coming up with unknown at the moment. Yeah. Yeah. You Why get a better range. Sure must be, must be awful uh, sensors. Pulse lasers go overheat and are powered off at the same time as their shields go offline. Right, so which faction? The Erinan's People Party? That's yeah, the one. Yes. The people of Erinan. Oh! Oh yes, you're all green now. Are there any red people here at all? Yeah, there's a handful of red. Enemies are getting blown, blown up so quickly. They're chasing them away, actually. Yeah, we'll take them all. Going down! Oh, ah, Commander Flossy! Greetings, Commander! Are they jumping around, like, erratically on anyone else's screen? Yeah. Yeah, I just got yeah. there. Yeah, yeah that looks like you're It's because there's so many of us, actually. Oh! Maybe quite a lot. I've only got myself one day in the at the moment, but... 
And Harley, I'm getting shot. Getting closer. Yeah, if you go to, for the uh, free side, it puts you way back at Azaban Orbital. Oh, yes, so yes, it seems, kill. yeah. So that, that's, I think that's the default mode, it's designed so that you uh, you go back mm -hmm. as you get killed by someone, you know, you kind of always reset back to that common location. That's it. Obviously that will be spread out a little bit more when we... Uh, get cool. Got the Grimmy here, and I've got Crash here. Right there. I'm not seeing anybody else at the moment. Oh, a land, yeah, there we go, a land. I know. <laughs> Gil, sorry, just Ooh. noticed the uh, the ship I had targeted was uh, had an expert rank, and he was flying all over the place, and I was kicking his backside really quickly. <laughs> when I uh, first spawned from Azaban Orbital on my way to Azaban City, I was interdicted by a dangerous uh, sidewinder. And that's what you took about. Yes, yeah. of course. <laughs> Bagged me seven and a half K. That's right, yeah. There's a I can see that. Yeah. I think I've been interdicted once or twice this time around, but then as soon as I upgraded my weapons to fight the interdictions, uh, I found that I wasn't being interdicted as so much. Yeah, yeah. Really yeah. I've not been interdicted another red guy. Guy at all. There's a lot of uh, stuff in the AI will yeah. notice your hardware and just leg it, and run away. <laughs> I don't want to die. Continue with the multi Monty Python analogy. It's brave, brave Sir Robin. Run away, Jack. <laughs> 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 Where is our Sir Robin? Is he is he commanding pilots? Probably. I did find it quite entertaining one of the uh, the guys I had on the stand saying, "Oh, I only fly in advert in." Inverted because that's how real pilots fly. I was like, uh, no, that's that's not how flight sticks work. <laughs> go, oh yes, but it, but it is. I go, well, would you like to talk to our RAF pilot? <laughs> 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 Who will call you out for being an idiot? <laughs> Absolutely. I. <laughs> Man, the, the cannons are so satisfying. Just a flesh man. wound. Even more so than they used to be. <laughs> Has the, the ammo explosions. rating been uh, nerfed on it though? The amount of ammo you can carry? Yeah, so you can only carry 105. Oh, that's uh, plenty. Only. That's plenty. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, four cannons completely and, empty uh, costs around about 400 credits to rearm. Yeah. So they're just slightly a bit more expensive. The still power's have a fun still time. there, I think. Maybe a little yeah, bit less. I, I mean, as, as I said earlier to you, I mean, the, the, they seem to travel slow. That's the only thing I've noticed that's been, that's been different. Yeah, they're quite a bit harder to uh, to hit. Like, even I, I run with trailing sights, mm -hmm. and you still have to lead with trailing sights in order in, to hit. In play yeah. here. Yeah. I would have a go at an anaconda. Finally got one! Yay! Yeah. So at least it's not walking around over the place. Yeah, I think yeah, we're all in the same zone. Just jumping just the, all over the shot. The rubber band is real. Cool, isn't that the conga? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Get him, get him. Got I don't him. see it. Okay, we'll club together and get the anaconda. Is he gonna finish this cover off? Hang on. Whoa! So close. Well, you see this flight trail, cool. it looks like it's skywriting. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, rubber banding anacondas could no uh, end up in dead Wreck your day. Whoa, Quick hitting just jumped wall. half a light year. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. It's too rough. Whoa! Please, what the f- What the, f oh. what the family- <laughs> <laughs> Okay, well done. Oh, <laughs> I'm just, just jumped miles. Six kilometers in the opposite direction. Yeah. <laughs> Wasn't me. I'm sure it's advanced be, technology. He's obviously upgraded to an improbability drive. That's right, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it would be anywhere in the universe. 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 They've moved the subsystems. Have they? Maybe the, fra is the frame shift is um, as easy it, to get to. It's off to the right rather than between oh the legs, my. as it were. 
Yeah, I think yeah, the um... Between the legs, I like that. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's the only way to take down an anaconda. Kick it between yeah. the legs. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Hang on, anacondas don't have legs. Even the real ones. Well, if you sh shoot it between the drives... <laughs> ah, Black is asking, does anyone oh. know what the uh, the ship is on this week's peak of the week? Was that, it was the Imperial Courier, wasn't it? The Imperial <laughs> something. It looked Imperial. Yeah. You could tell it was Imperial. That was just sexy. Oh, I didn't even look. I to bring up the newsletter. Take a peek. Take a sneak peek. Okay, come on. I will get some shots on this. I'm going to pick real luck it. because I can't get your me. Yeah, I'm having some severe issues with Twitching too so. much to shoot. Real luck. Unfortunately, it's not. <sighs> yeah, let's just. Uh... What one? I get what? the impression I'm not saying the same universe as everyone else is. <laughs> Um, if it's not choppy, probably not. I think my display no, is super gone choppy, strange. but it just sounds different. I'm gonna try try this. This should help. <laughs> Did anyone kill it? No, no it's, it's still teleporting all over the shop. Oh, it's well, it's just dropped off of my screen. Did anyone kill what? Sorry. Anaconda. Anaconda. Oh, okay. My my display has gone strange. I'm using a Rift, but uh, my main monitor's turned Ooh. off. Oh, are you? And my oh, display has just gone fancy. Flip around <laughs> 90 degrees. Oh, you've got yeah, you got you got the DK2 with DK1. Yeah. You yeah. have to forgive it, Elan. He's been on the vodka tonight. Oh, my I've had game to just frozen. Kill the process. Oh, it's not bad. I think it was my graphics drive that was strange. Four, three, two, one, really? engage. So they crash. Uh, who else at EGX was actually demoing Elite with their products? The Oculus. The you mean? Oculus, where were they? Weren't NVIDIA also playing? Um... Oh, we had, I think, yeah, we had the NVIDIA guys were showing something. We had the scan.co.uk guys. Um, the Turtle, the Beach. Turtle Beach, that was it, yeah. I think people were just showing off Elite in one so form or another. Does this mean that NVIDIA might maybe start some optimization for Elite? Mm. Ooh, well, that would be nice. They will have to at some point. <laughs> yes, yeah, so when everyone in the everyone who has a PC has a suit to Elite, then they'll need to. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I mean, obviously they, they kind of work with... Uh, driver vendors work with developers to kind of get the optimizations in there. That's usually closer to the point of release. Has anyone else got this Viper got jumping back and forward at 100 miles per hour? Oh, I did have him. I found <laughs> another <laughs> one so He should have found some of you. Well, yeah, he's he's on improbability drivers on 10 files. Yeah, yeah, I'm all on my own with his Anaconda 26 health and he's uh, he's whipping me a little bit at the moment. Oh, I got and up. I'm also ah! 16 kilometers away from the uh, from the point. <laughs> I'm gonna rejoin the game. Oh shoot! Oh, oh I'm on my own. Oh no! To die. I wonder if I was hosting the session when I killed my uh, process. Ah, uh, might have. That kicked everyone. <laughs> Uh, oh no, here to play. And we overloaded the server the wrong all along. By being in the same place <laughs> at the same time. <laughs> and we've seen a 99 film for a time cop where the guy gets kicked into his early descent. He's got to find his position. Oh! To try and blob of slug. That's. Uh oh, that's I'm sorry. That's perhaps the server right. Eject. It's got the same. Right. I'll, you know, I think on shot. I think the um, the anaconda's been worked on even more. The texture's got even even better than the model. Yeah, I think all yeah, the ships are very really yeah, hard to pass from one place to another. One to get some film for the show. Yeah, that's <laughs> great.
it's I'd twitchier than some of the EGX entrants have just been done. We've got um, Oculus on the stand. No, oh, Ed corrected us then, and NVIDIA weren't showing us. I think it was just the scan guys on the front. Well, they were just like five seconds away. NVIDIA, they should, well, they should have been. Yeah, frozen. It, they missed a great opportunity for minutes. Whoa, 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 slow down, slow down. Uh oh, you might have frozen. Yeah, yeah. me too. Have we got a full one? Man's I'm frozen. Close look at Man's frozen. Hey. Ed, sort it out. <laughs> Back in the office. Two point zero five. We're waiting. <laughs> Come on, Ed. Yeah, this is a control at delete. Big yeah, guns coming out. Uh, have to nuke the game. End the process thing. End the process. Oh, Mizau on my chat is uh, asking what factions there are. I think there are loads of different factions out there. Really. <laughs> <laughs> it's not just yeah, a case of the um, two, like yeah. Mm. Every system will have there's I loads. Think, at least two factions. Yeah. Oh, them and us. <laughs> <That's>, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's not it's not as clear cut as it used to be in the original game. It's no longer Feds, Imperial, and Alliance. It's literally Ooh. all independent systems can technically have like their own factions. It's um, I mean, like especially in Erinin, when when you're looking through the mission list on Erinin, it's like uh, different political parties. Like yeah. you've got the Erinin left and the you know all that kind of stuff. It's very, yeah, very it's near a symbol. Yeah, I think there's there's two major powers in there: like Federation and Empire. And then there's a minor and power alliance, alliance, mm -hmm. and then there's Woo. independent factions as well that aren't allied to any 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 other pa uh, any the, of those three. The alliance are a conglomeration of uh, independents. That's right. Mm. They're an, an so, alliance. Yeah. Oh, someone just had a collision with the. Uh... Ooh. I believe um, to be a member of the alliance, they have to sort of um, uh, not donate, but. Offer some of their army, their their navy or whatever to to the uh, to the independent the uh, alliance cause, you know, a bit like NATO. Yeah. 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 Well, it's um, alliance based on the EU, isn't it? But without the hats. Oh, is it actually based on the EU? I didn't realise that. Well, but yeah, uh, it does make Michael sense. Michael Brooks keeps on saying it is, so I'm just going to go with him. Yeah, what Michael <laughs> says goes. That's right. <laughs> yeah, pretty much in all cases. What, what MB says goes. Absolutely. And he still has to go past DB. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try and find a better sensor because I can't be dealing with this about 500 kilometer range. Not kilometer, what am I thinking of? Uh, 500 meter range. I think, can you not increase the range of your sensors? There is a. Yeah, but it's just button. it's just not identifying or, you know, it, they're, they're sort of the, on the scanner, they've come up with the glitchy things. The glitchy triangle things. Yeah. yeah. Rather than uh, they don't resolve, I guess is the, the way I'm looking yeah, for. Buy upgrades to use standard sensors. Yeah, yes. that's what I'm going to look for now. So I think, well, I don't know, I think the standard is 4 kilometers and I've got an upgrade that takes it to 6 kilometers, so maybe with the more power you can supply to it, the bigger the ship you have, the longer the range you can identify targets. So I hadn't actually investigated much of the other equipment. I just headed off into the unknown as soon as I uh, got the beta and then got lost. Ed came in. Yeah, I mean, the start of it was just fantastic because you spawned on an outpost. So you just got as soon as you yeah. went onto the platform and went, hey, this isn't the space station, but in space. <laughs> yeah, where's the rest of the space station? Where's I'm the right next to it. <laughs> this is the planet. The roof. It's topless. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The space station. Space station. Yeah, the, I mean the first look of that planet from so, from so close was just mind blowing. You know, <laughs> loved it. It's pretty incredible. That was a nice surprise, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah, docking at the outpost in Oh dear, crash. What? Just, uh, look, just looking at your stream. I'm cheating. Whoopsie, oh, he oh. himself. I'm cheating. <laughs> <laughs> Did you test the system defences? I, I, I was I was <laughs> testing the self destruct button. It was nothing to do with the cost of preparing from one percent hull damage. <laughs> oh really? Okay. <laughs> it was like <laughs> boom. <laughs> Where was the last time you docked? 
Uh, uh, right at that port. Oh, okay, handy. Dock, land, come back out. <laughs> Boom! Are you guys still in the fight? About to ask that, I'm just I had to try. Oh, I, I can't. I can't get back in because my screen has gone all strange. Uh, I I headbutted an anaconda, yeah. so I'm back at Azvan <laughs> City. <laughs> <laughs> if all else fails, <laughs> ram it. Well, well, I couldn't just, remember uh, my button for cycle next subsystem, and then I decided that it it might have been my boost button. Mm. Decided <laughs> that it wasn't my boost button, and, as soon as you and then it. couldn't find the reverse button. Quick enough. <laughs> oh, take out some civilians. And on that note, I Don't think do it's time it. for more vodka. It's 21,000 credits vodka. to take out some civilians. Oh, crash with a bad, bad Why is it that you can get like 6,000 or 4,000 credits for like delivering a message, but for killing someone in battle, you get like 300 credits? <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, yeah. The first thing don't I know what was danger deliver. money is. First thing I did was deliver fish for twelve thousand credits, just two fish. <laughs> <laughs> so I think, think um, that's right. a lot of money for pilchards for your tea, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, but you can make like five thousand fish for that. So I think I. Uh, to be fair, it is in tons. I took a single can of tea from oh, um, back in. Dahan to LP ninety eight dash one three two, and I got eighteen thousand credits for it. It's like Ow. for one, one canister of tea. Okay. I'll oh. take that. <laughs> Chachings. Released. Engines engaged. Must really need their tea. Absolutely. What are you chaps doing now? I'm. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be naughty because I'm never naughty. <laughs> the ore is not. I'm just heading to B2 to, to see if they've got any scanner upgrades. Well, I managed to lose a missile that was targeted on me by going to sell Ah, running. greetings, Commander Dark Matter Generator. Where the devil are you? So when I found something Bro, please. Chase. Does, has anyone tried the chaff out against me? Try charging. Uh, no, to tell you honest, I, I, I haven't really gotten into enough situations with missiles firing at me to, uh, to no. need it yet. <laughs> I just buy it. I just buy it six times. Well, I feel like that's the best way of doing it. See, I just enjoy all the boring, peaceful ways of making money. That's my problem. Well, that's probably why I'm so bad at combat. I'm just peacefully exploring. So hey, there's quite a lot of red so ships over there now. Unnecessary. Where the hell is that guy? I've got a question here, guys, from Filmo. Are any of you others streaming right now? I don't think you are, are you? Not uh, right now, no. but I do. Is not right, right now. Uh, I've got it offline. Uh, not is right now, streaming, not and streaming. I don't ever. <laughs> oh. no, I, I use it Probably not, just yeah. the videos. I don't think the stream with a riff would work very well. No, <laughs> uh, but did you see that post that um, Eddie Simons put up for us? A post? Yes. Oh, there for the, the single screen. Yeah. yeah, I did see that. Yes. So yeah, so the thing we had at EGX where we had the double double screen was just split down to a single screen so that everyone behind without the watching, um, without the distortion the and everything. Yeah, so, um, yeah. He went away and checked and found out that we could actually obviously it's an unsupported debug feature, but we could actually uh, tell everyone about it and use it. So we put the details up on the forum for everyone to read, which is really oh. handy if you want to um, capture the riff oh. and let other people see it. Yeah, it, it's just a little hook into the app config, I believe. Yeah, you just change the XML file, you cut and paste the values in, that's pretty much it. So oh yeah, the extra screen on the Rift just blew my mind at EGX. <laughs> I have to tell people, is it okay that I tell people, Eddie? <laughs> yeah. Yes. Tweet, it, tweet, though, tweet. Come well yeah, I, yeah, obviously, I think it was just a case of can we tell them how it's done, you know. Oh. And uh, that was the thing he wanted to check for us. And he went away and checked, and fair play to him, he got back the next day and let us know. So, 
Because I was good looking on you, utility online to see if they could, that would do exactly the same thing, but I don't actually think there is anything that exists. I was I was talking to Eddie, and I was gonna make something which would uh, apply the opposite pixel shader to remove the distortion and capture it back to a flat window, uh, which was uh, gonna prove very tricky. But I was halfway along to it. I got captured. I was just working on the distortion, um, uh, and then he turned me and said, "Well, you know," he said, "We well, can just do the X amount." I was like, "Ah, great! That saves oh me a God. heck of a lot of time." <laughs> Are, are none of you at the uh, combat place anymore? I was. Yeah, yeah, I'm still here. <laughs> oh, yeah, shield ripped. Well, I, 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 just got, went, I got toasted. I went back, joined the side, but none of you were there, so they just annihilated me. No. <laughs> yeah, I, I like, headed oh. off because I, I got my backside handed to me I'm by an anaconda. I'm and the hammer in the crap oh. I need to save up for a yeah. The balance has swung in favour of the other side, I think. <laughs> Quite heavily. Oh, I'm dead. I just bought some a better scanner, eject, so, eject. or better sensors. So. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna die. Nice knowing you all. <laughs> We're gonna head back over. You're gonna cost me destroy by shit, right? What? Killed me. What? Then you can think I'll have a free strike on it. Mr. Bossman's asking if the Viper is worth getting. What do you guys think? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Yes. Yeah. Nah. Oh, it's free, know. so is it worth getting? <laughs> Viper. <laughs> if someone said to you, here's a free car, or you could buy a hundred thousand pound Ferrari. It's free if you had no enough money. credits and modified your previous vehicle sufficiently. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they actually, I modified my Eagle so much they actually gave me, uh, I think, 30,000 credits for buying a Viper. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, you can, you can make the jump range viable, you can, well, everything else is already viable, so yeah, there's nothing really to worry about with a Viper. I did actually. It's very good. I mean, I, I spent most of my time with Beta 1 in the Viper, and I really have missed it. <laughs> now, now I'm finally back in one, like, oh, this is, this is fun. <laughs> I mean, so I, I, I love the Viper for fun, it's brilliant. Although there are 25 main, uh, ships in the game, there's effectively, like, a lot more than that, because how much you can change each individual ship. Yeah. Oh, God, yeah. The this is why I like, I mean, you can amazing. pimp your ride. I mean, you know, you start with a basic sidewinder, but you know, after a paint job and a few dodgy little guns added, yeah. you know, cargo yeah. hold, beer, high That's, that's what I really like, it kind of reminds me of, like, Forza, uh, Gran Turismo, that sort of thing, where you can get, like, the, the yeah. mini... Eddie's actually in the chat, right, right, I believe. Overflux. Oh, yeah, he is. We were just talking about you spit the devil and he won't he will come. <laughs> Don't tell him what we were saying. <laughs> <laughs> I always heard everything you said. Well, I mean I love the customization, but I think we need to be able to have the twice strips and pop the ships and that's what we need for space. Absolutely. I mean, you know, Deep Eddie, yeah. hydraulics. Stupid. Eddie, totally unnecessary air vent. Tell tell me more of this ship that's going to surpass the Viper. <laughs> I am very much intrigued. <laughs> is, it, is it made by, by the Empire by, by any chance? Uh, <laughs> See, that was a nice subtle little thing. I didn't, I didn't know if anyone would pick up on what he said in the. Is uh, everyone going to the nav beacon? Is this, is I'm off at the nav beacon right? at the moment. Yeah. Okay. Oh, which nav beacon? Sorry. Uh, Erin, I believe. Okay, cool. <laughs> Dedicated or obsessed? That is the question. <laughs> what are we doing? We're going back to the. Uh, where are we going now? To the net beacon. In our room. Some FSD weeks there. I think uh, we should take this opportunity to congratulate and thank the dev team for their supreme yeah. efforts over the absolutely. last week. Hats off it's been guys. absolutely incredible, like a build a day. It's, it's been <laughs> <laughs> more content, more content. Well, I, mean, I, I tweeted, you know, I think mean, it's a triumph, you know, as a software developer, but in a completely different field, you know, you have to take your hats off to these guys. The stuff that they've done is just fantastic. Yeah, absolutely. Should I pick on an anaconda? Mm. That doesn't sound like fun. And on Saturday night, I'm oh, talking about a 10pm launch on Tuesday. Seems I wasn't far off. <laughs> oh, my screen's come back. Warning, detecting hostile scan. I don't think I've actually managed to find uh, the upgraded thrusters yet, actually. That's something I wanted to try. Some uh, Joada was just asking on the chat here. 
because obviously you can upgrade the thruster, so you could make the sidewinder a little bit more proficient maneuvering wise. I haven't upgraded the sidewinder, but I've upgraded the Viper, and it seems to work quite well. But you need to like look at the stats because not necessarily every option you can buy is going to be an upgrade. Yeah. Some of them, some of them are power saving more than anything else, or or, or mass saving. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I have just noticed that the um, uh, the Viper doesn't boost to 500 anymore, and you boost to 380 by default. So, so uh, I'll have to be uh, looking into some uh, new thrusters at some point. <laughs> Will the turbo boost on kits be nerfed? Ouch. Yeah. But then, like I'm saying, I mean, if you get the right thrusters in there, you can probably get that up anyway. Yeah. I mean, I think my next upgrade for thrusters is half a million. Oh, from hey. 50 grand. Just think of the insurance Everything cost on that. Alright. Right. Everything's got its pros and cons. The first person I see has 200 credit bounty, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do. Everyone else is clean. <laughs> How about him? Attacking the they propagation. Well. I'm never a bad guy, so you know, I thought I'd have a change to see. Well, I mean, he's got a face in the so it's his. his fault. Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't attack someone without the. Why not? Crash your pit if you want it. I'm just a bounty hunter slash scavenger person. I'm not really a... Uh... Oh, I've had someone else just turn hostile. He's clean. I can't shoot you, mate. You yeah, the million dollar person. cargo scanner had better scan cargo from another system. <laughs> Running away. I'd like, like to know from the, 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 the devs what mechanism decides which stars to include. Uh. Isn't it how close they are? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, Eddie, when, if station security is scanning you, that's a kill warrant scanner or a um, cargo scanner, which isn't that already supposed to be a hostile act? Uh. I'm heading Good for question. the sun. Slow down, it says. I'm not going to slow down. Oh god, oh god. Go into the middle of it. I kind of think that they. Well, I'm not sure if the Fed's outer nav points have cargo scanners because I've had plenty of illicit cargo and no one's ever pinged me for it. <laughs> Conversely, I have been at least in previous beta. Yeah, previous beta. Yeah, previous beta exchange. Because I think now there's yeah. a limit to uh, how much stuff they can carry, so they can they have to choose: are they going to scan for, scan for cargo, or are they going to scan for? Um, yeah. yeah, exactly. I like that. Though. I mean, I, I think it adds a really nice level of depth to the way you've got to think really hard of it. One on the I think that's really cool. I want guns. Guns. <laughs> Bigger guns. <laughs> I don't care if you've got cargo or not, I'm going to shoot you until you drop something. <laughs> shoot, shoot, shoot. Be that parts of your hull or cargo, I don't care. Well, that, that's ah, if lovely. you've got a bounty on your head already, you know, I'd have some else. I went to the sun instead of the nav beacon. Ah, where's the frame shift to come back online? How's that sun tan? Um, well, considering I was flat out and just couldn't slow down and just literally came out in an emergency stop. So, like, kind of hitting black ice and coming off the road, just kind of flying out. And... This is one thing I've got to ask Eddie actually is uh, are the radiators less efficient when you're closer to a star? Because I found that they seem to. Your temperature seems to get really, really hot when you uh, crash near a star. Uh, as someone whose temperature is above 250% and there's sparks coming off everything, <laughs> <of the theme, laughs> I'd say yes. percent That confirms I'll say that. Yes. <laughs> Being near a sun is not good for you. I think I'm going to go through my second sidewinder this evening. This <laughs> yeah. Everyone's running oh, away. Okay, temperature's now down below 100%. Now I'm super cruising. Oh, you'll be fine. Uh, you'll be fine. Oh. I'll be burning nicely.
Chinwad is encouraging me to get a bigger bounty on my head. And that's just because people want to get me. Yeah, but I mean, there's probably some Holy, forum you've been thread at me. that says, bring me the head of I threw a little cheeky shot off. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to tease what? you, but I got a bounty and that made me sad. Uh, there's a DMG on my chat is asking if uh, you can get a scanner which is, tells the difference between a regular FSD jump and a uh, jump for SSD. Uh, for yes. Hundreds, I think it actually shows up as like high energy or low energy and it doesn't anyway. So uh, if, uh, I think there was one, I was looking at him, and I think it showed a uh, scanner for scanning jumps to super cruise and another scanner for uh, jumping into the hyperspace. Hmm. Yeah, but he was actually asking about the surge that you see when you're actually targeting someone. I don't think that's currently possible. Once they've jumped, you can follow them after that if you have the correct scanner. Yeah. 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 Eddie would be the one to answer that question. Eddie's always in there. He is my, um, or, or he my youngest has just come back from youth club and uh, is Tell wearing his Elite sure. Dangerous t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> right on, Commander. Right That's on. what I said, I, I'm going to have to drop a, a, a mail to uh, Ali or Jess and say we, you know, we want kids size clothing. So I can uh, get my kids to wear it as well. I know, I've got a small t-shirt, put it on a seven year old, absolutely drowned him. <laughs> Yeah, it's even the smallest one. He loves it, though. He loves, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I think Something an elite t-shirt that just has a caption on the, on the front, you know, for like toddler that just says, my dad's mostly harmless. <laughs> 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 oh, like pilot cadet. Target shield online. Go, 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 go. Get in there. Target shields offline. Bigger lasers. Um, Your shields are just about to. Go. Oh no! Don't! Oh! Oh! Pete's area. I I don't need a higher rate of fire when I'm when cannon shells do the amount of damage that they do. My hull's done forty five percent already. Oh, it's just it's just my summary. Don't! Don't! Target destroyed. I saw it, Pete. It's still highlighted on my screen. Alright, ra rally uh, mode engaged, whoever that was, come back. Man, Sidewide is just uh, so quiet on the, on the scanner. I have to get really close oh, to the yeah. to actually target them. What an upgrade. Ah. <laughs> no, 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 Guys, shall we yeah, drop the roof and go um, open, and then we can chat open. and join us in uh, in uh, Aaron and Beacon. That should be absolutely. Yeah. You've got enough people watching that. Uh, yeah, we, we're we're going to get completely swamped, but that sounds cool. <laughs> <laughs> sounds like blown fun. up, I suspect. Let's give it a go. Uh, I'm going to drop group. I'm oh, going open all. Go on then. Okay, peeps. Okay, I'm going to take the opportunity to reboot my computer, so I shall be back in a minute. Cool stuff. Sweet. All right. Hopefully. Right. Uh, to open then, I guess. Yep. Yep. Oh, I see the movie of the spinning orange ship. That is the problem. Damn. Damn. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Was it? Why is it doing that again? What? Uh, central system. Shields offline. Except they're not. Yes. Mm, oh, pretty sidewinder. So <laughs> yes, I have just opened stream. I was thinking about doing that. Damn it. <laughs> oh, fuck. Are uh... we heading back to a particular point now? We're back in open place. <sighs> Mind you, if I was streaming, they'd hear warts and all coughing and sniffing and all that business, so maybe it's be best if I don't. Well, I've ah. been to Azaban Orbital, I've never been to Erenin Survey. That's good to know. So Ed has just confirmed the um, surge detected messages. They're looking into lots of different uh, messages for that to make it a bit more specific and useful. Ah. Very nice. Okay, I get a shields offline message every time I load in. Shields yeah. are clearly online. 
Yeah, shield drive line and then uh, atmosphere. Atmosphere, atmosphere. atmosphere restored, yeah. yeah. Arathon, I am right behind you. Have you actually right, heading to over uh, your server, yeah? modules by any chance? Sorry? Just got if you look stuff. at your modules page, is your usage higher than your output? Which no. would then cause your stuff to go offline. No. Uh, well, mine's standard, I don't upgrade anything. So. <laughs> no, <laughs> I, think, I think that's just a bug because I get it as well. Bug. Another thing, another th thing to ticket, I guess. Yeah, a lot of distortion on my. Uh... Yeah, that doesn't help. That doesn't so, Erin in for server, yeah. Tetric. Hello. Uh, I, I had my lighting correct. Max. <laughs> Yer. On the subject of Max, has anyone met Deal Good since the old day? Uh, I have indeed. Yeah, he I think Elan, yeah, because he was a, a bounty hunter, wasn't he, on your stream? Is that right? Did he ram you in this occasion, or was he better behaved than he used to be? <laughs> he when was, I saw uh, him, oh, he I was actually a, uh, a Federation pilot. He, he scanned me and said, all good here, pilot. <laughs> Continue. I think it's like, probably what? a bounty hunter. <laughs> ah, he's, he's changed his evil ways. Oh, so Max is going all out pirating. Mm. Got one player. Let's go and check who this is. Please, private. <laughs> private here. Be right One second. It's not far off pirating, though, is it? Let's be honest. I mean, even in the word kind of a way. <laughs> <laughs> Well, private teaming is just state sponsored piracy. So, we head into the oh, map so, so you're pirating for the cause, then, I guess. Yeah, the Imperials. Imperials? I thought you were a federation. Ah, uh, yeah, Drive actually. Charging. I'm a federation. <laughs> <laughs> Four, three, two, one, engage. Thanks, Elan. But you shot me! Ooh, someone just blew up. <laughs> when? Yeah, just I agree, so I the, uh, the Sidewinder is definitely not. Well, I see Elan, I haven't seen him all, all night, actually. I think it's just the, cu the customizable option. Oh, dude, he's a Viper. Makes a difference. I see Grondane, he's also a Viper. Ooh, there's some players. Who's this? I'm with Tetric and Grondane at the moment. Yeah. Commander Kualala. Who's this? Commander Waziman. Have we got more people on the uh, chat than usual there, Crash, or have we put everyone off? Uh, I don't know. I don't you, so. I am nine and a half kilometres out from the beacon. Maybe that would be. Someone's just there. come tearing past me into their own survey. <laughs> yeah, guilty. I'm just disengaging safely now. Because there wasn't any unsafe and get disengaging available. <laughs> Will there be a beta for it? OMG! <laughs> <laughs> Every little scrap of news, and, and then suddenly we've got people asking, it's like, what about the next thing? What about the next thing? <laughs> well, isn't isn't there meant gamma? to be another month between yeah. uh, beta and release? Sorry, between beta 3 and release, anyway. Yeah. That's great, though. Oh, someone's got an ask. No, it's not a human. Not fair. Alright, I'm sitting 236 meters away from the, uh, from the nav beacon. Oh, things are jumping in now. Hooray! People, are you, are you wanted? No. Uh, no, I'm, I'm a good little boy now. <laughs> now. Uh, <laughs> Black is screaming at me, he wants to know Damn. when the planetary landings are going to be out. 
Oh, well, apparently I have a local bounty of zero credits. However, my UI disagrees. <laughs> There's a, a guy, I don't know if you pronounce this, Q the Sham Bacharach. I think you got obviously it. Obviously, the NPC, but. Oh, someone's just buzzed me at high speed in a cooler. <laughs> ah. I wonder who that could be. That'll be. Pahimo Taidoka. I'm wondering whether Eddie has had a chance to see the thing I spoke to him about with slower speed of light. Have you guys heard of that? No. It, it was like a little, uh, it was like a student project or something like that. Some guys at some university did it. Um, come on, drop out. And uh, it kind of messed around with like the laws of physics at the close to the speed of light and things like that. It was like a first person right. collect them up type thing, and it had some really really weird lighting effects and things as you got closer mm -hmm. and closer to the speed of light. It was really really interesting. Oh, I've got Grimmy, I've got Ryan. Howdy. I've dropped my cargo scoop. <laughs> I see <laughs> someone <laughs> flying straight towards oh, me. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> Nudge. <laughs> it's seen the engineer of that. Ah, I can, yeah. I don't know where I am, there's a lot of ships here. Fly over the top. You can actually, if, with the sidewinders, because Go it's literally top. just a, a flap that drops down, you can actually wedge someone in that. Can you? Go on and block tape <laughs> you can't go escape, let's see what you got there. <laughs> oh, I didn't even hear it open. Well, the landing gear as well. Yeah, I'll tell you what it makes me, re reminds me of, and the old Eubank push hoovers. <laughs> <laughs> All it needs is a, is a wooden handle coming out the top of that, and then there you are, you've got sidewinder, stroke, vacuum cleaner. What skin have you got on this Viper? Uh, a red... Uh, the red one. I can't remember the name of it. What right. is it called? Leave the, uh, leave the cargo scooper oh, yeah. and I'll, um, I'll fly underneath. Yeah, it's, it's my favourite. It's uh, Starsky and Hutch. Yeah, it is. That's uh, Viper. <laughs> <laughs> sure it's not turn the General Lee. <laughs> yeah. Your optional um, horn for when you're uh, going and jumping into hyperspace. <laughs> <laughs> Probably uh, programmed that.